G'day everyone. I'm going to try an experiment. A banana experiment. You look up here. We've got a lovely bunch of bananas. And they're ripening really, really slowly. So what I thought I'd do is if I get that, pull it down a little, I'm going to cut a couple of the larger ones off. If I can reach them. There they are. Oh, golly. It's very flat. Two bananas. They're not ready yet, obviously. But I'm going to take them inside, put them in a bag, and see if they ripen. Let's do that now. So we have two bananas. Banana eye. And one we're just going to leave out on the bench. The other we're going to put in a plastic bag, along with another banana because they use gas to ripen these. And it'll release the gas and hopefully ripen that banana. But we shall see. So we've got our experiment set up. We will be back to see how B1 and B2 get on. Well, it's time to check in with B1 and B2. B1, who was just left out, is still as green as ever. Nothing has happened, or well, nothing much. But the B2 that we put in with another banana, B3, no, there's no B3, is there? appears to have ripened. Now, I know I picked these way too early, but let's open it up and see what it's like. Oh, wow. There's a banana in there. It's a small banana. It's soft and creamy like it's meant to be. Let's have a taste. Definitely needed to be ripened a bit more on the tree. Do you like banana? That has a strong banana taste to it. I think that, oh, these are going to be really, really nice once they've ripened properly. We can ripen them in a bag, but don't pick them this early. So we'll leave the others on the tree for another few weeks or maybe months. I don't know. I don't know how long it takes. And we'll see how they come out. But these are very tasty bananas, very different. Hopefully you've got some bananas growing, and if you do, let me know what varieties in a comment. Enjoy life, enjoy your bananas, and I'll catch you in the garden.